St. Thomas Aquinas students proudly took to the stage last night as another year graduated from high school. After an introduction from Dean Woodbeck, the Whitefish Bay singers performed the traditional honor song for the graduates. <laughs> Director of Education Phyllis Acri addressed the grads congratulating them on taking another big step forward in their lives. One need only read any set of English essays, look at any science projects, or walk up to the foyer and enjoy the art that is displayed there to see how well developed this class of 2014 is. Following the speeches and opening remarks, the high school students were given their diplomas along with any bursaries or scholarships they had earned from their hard work. McKenna is receiving a subject award for band and is graduating with honors throughout. The grand finale of the evening was the valedictorian speech. This year's valedictorian, as voted by his peers, was Nicholas Philippow. Good evening, class of 2014. I'd like to kick things off by welcoming parents, guardians, teachers, distinguished guests, and of course, all of you awesome guys and gals who have had, whom I've had the honor of knowing over the past several years. Now, I've been tearing my hair out over the past few weeks trying to write a speech that would live up to what all of you rightfully deserve. But standing beside all of you here now, I've decided no. True greatness doesn't come later on paper. It comes from your heart and your soul. And that's exactly how I'm going to deliver the speech to you. After Philip Howe's speech, all that was left to do was introduce the latest students to graduate from St. Thomas Aquinas. So ladies and gentlemen, it gives me great pleasure to present to you, for the first time officially, the St. Thomas Aquinas High School Class of 2014. From St. Thomas Aquinas, I'm Grace Protopappas for the KenoraOnline.com Newsroom.